What's the crack lads? What is going on? Hope you guys are good and we are back with a weekly roundup. So every Thursday we do this. If you are not at your console, we are going to go through everything that's on offer. But look, this is pretty much rinse and repeat now because, I mean, apart from the new uh, cars that are going to be added every week, um, until a new mode comes or something, you know, brand new comes, this is going to be the pattern that follows every week, apart from a couple of different bits and pieces. There's a couple of things that I still enjoy, um, and we'll crack on with a live stream today as well. But yeah, inauthentic match, just to go through this as quickly as possible, there's still nothing there, um, no official event or anything like that. Everything is Dream Team related, right? Which, you know, makes sense. The eFootball League, I think there's like, what, one week left in that? Or maybe, yeah, I think that's over the 28th. So you will reset two or three divisions. I'm in my road to glory here. Uh, we're having a bit of crack with that. Um, other than that, the events that are on, we have the same kind of style events. You still have your debut match if you haven't done that, if you're a newcomer, and the starter match if you haven't done that and you're a newcomer. And then you've got the national teams, the tie leagues, uh, the tie league and the golden goal is back for user matches with national team user matches, English clubs against the AI. They were there from the other day. So these two are new. Um, the golden goal in the national team you get your uh, training points in that um, as well as a couple of other bits and pieces you get 20,000 trainer another 20,000 trainer for that I mean look it's something it's something to grind it's the same with this with the skill trainers you can pick any of the teams here and you have to win one match win a second match and win a third match you get 50 e football coins for the first one and then you get your skill trainers so you get three skill trainers at 10,000 each um, listen, the events at the moment are literally an introduction into eFootball League, or else if you are playing the events every week, there's probably enough content in there for maybe five or six hours. You still have the event going on with the Legend Challenge thing as well, which is quite fun. The victory run, I know people are complaining about the Legend AI, but listen, it's a bit of a challenge, it's difficult, maybe a bit too difficult. Um, but we also have a couple of new things here, right? So like, let's just go through a couple of things here um, because we do have a brand new Neymar that has been added and we also get our eFootball Strike kit as well. So I'll, uh, I'll leave them and I'll show you them on the stream later, but they are pretty much the same style kit as we've had with the free one with the yellow and the blue. Neymar, this Neymar card here, um, they also are giving away that Neymar card for everybody. So all you have to do is log in and you will get that Neymar card there. Goes to 95 overall as a SS. Um, and Neymar is even wearing a new eFootball jersey there. They seem to have unlimited jerseys and designs of these. Um, but you also get with this Neymar card, you get 80,000 GP and 20,000 trainers with the campaign objectives. So this is similar to the Messi card that they released. I've no doubt that this Neymar card is going to be completely overpowered, um, but we will have a look at his card properly um, when we do get it later on. He goes to a 95 overall. That will be waiting for you in the inbox. All you have to do is go into your inbox and just claim everything. I'll do that on stream later, so make sure you watch it um, because he'll be going straight into our team. And for someone like me, look, we have free Messi in this Road to Glory. For somebody like me playing on a Road to Glory here and not playing with my main squad, and if you're a newcomer and you don't have a beastly squad, um, if you've got a collective strength under 2,700, you're probably going to be starting out, right? And you probably haven't spent anything or anything like that. This Neymar is going to make a huge difference for me in this type of squad. But on my other squad, it's not going to even get make the bench because I have about four or five different versions of, of Messi and Neymar. So no matter which free version they give me, I'm going to have a better version there or very close to that. Um, in terms of the missions and all that, this is still ongoing. You've got all of these still ongoing with the objectives. There's nothing really new in there, except obviously the new one, Neymar's New Journey. If you want to do that, you just have to feature that Neymar Junior card and win in the tour event. Very, very easy. Very, very simple. I don't even think you need, you can just sim the games. And then the rest is all about the cards. I've already done a review on these player of the weeks, probably the worst player of the week selections that they've probably put out. I would say it's it's really, really bad. Um, and then also these worldwide September ones, apart from a couple of players here, Dembele is, is, is a notable option. It's a poor selection as well. Um, and I think that at the moment there's just... The problem is, man, we're going to get into this on the live stream later, but for anyone just watching this video and can't make the live stream, the problem at the moment, in my opinion, um, with, the, with the game is a wider issue than just the cards. It's that there's so many cards awash, like literally in the, in, in the ecosystem or in the ocean of Dream Team that like literally a card like Dembele that goes to a 96 overall, like there's no like, oh, I have to get that card. That card is a beastly card. It'll be one of the best wingers in the game because there's probably 50 other options you can have there 
instead of going for Dembele. So that's the biggest problem at the moment is that like the game is it gives you too much stuff at the start. Even with a road to Gloria, you're if you're trying to stay grind and you're trying to stay as grindy as possible with spending nothing, spinning nothing, even the free rewards, it still gives you a ton of stuff like GP and stuff. And you have to spend it. I mean, what's the point holding on to it? We also have the Spanish September um, selection. Now, this is a pretty decent selection. This is always kind of a pretty decent selection, especially because you can clear this agent. And I would say that there's two or three players in here that are definitely worth it. Gundo, Rodrigo, Marcus Lorente. Lorente is always a beastly player, and this card looks fairly decent as well. So I do like that. Um, you also have this guy is, a, is quite decent as well as a center back, if you were able to get him. Um, and Isco is always fun to play with, with that beautiful ball control. Bit slow, but look, you have to take that when it comes. Um, and then you have all the rest of these going on uh, as well. I mean, look at how many packs there are. There's just so much stuff going on. We'll get into that in a, in a little bit later on as well. Or else, if I put up this video after the stream, I'll have covered it in the stream so you can go back and watch it. But, as I said, when you have a player that you can go in and you can literally get one of the best players in the game for, I don't know, let's say, like, you know, you can get Modric for 180,000 GP. You can raise 180,000 GP within an hour of playing and get Modric. You could have another hour of game playing and get Marquinhos. And then you're kind of set with your attacking midfielder and your center back. So it's kind of like you don't really need to improve those players apart from training them up. So, um, yeah, that is it. But as I said, you do also get this kit. This is the kit, the special login present that was available a couple of days ago. They've now actually added that to everybody's game. So you'll be able to choose it um, and it will go in here. It'll be in with the rest of the kits in here. Um, so you'll be able to see it in there. So that is it for me, lads. I will talk to you guys later. Um, actually, here, we'll show you the kit. We'll show you the kit. Um, we'll show you this kit. So you just go into my team there. I have a video of how to change it. But that's basically the kit there modeled by Juan Basaka. So, look, it's all right. I mean, they haven't added the option to put custom kits in yet, but when they do, I think it'll look pretty decent. But that is it for your weekly roundup, lads. I will be back quite soon. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll catch you in the live stream. Peace.